Also, Richard, the Inspiration Through Innovation event is happening on the 9th and 10th of October. You're hosting it, but it's not just about you, is it? No, it's absolutely not about us, Lindsay. We, we um, yeah, I mean, we've got this fantastic building, which actually right at this moment in time, we're making some alterations to be able to make changes for, uh, for the event this year. I mean, it, it's wonderful for us to be able to host that. Uh, but actually, this year, again, the focus is on innovation. It is on sharing back best practice, but, it, but it's particularly focused even more on collaboration, okay. on working together. Um, and, and so, you know, it, it's absolutely not a CECO event. It's mm -hmm. a collaborative event where we've got 40 plus technology partners coming in again um, and being very, very focused on working together. So who's yeah. going to benefit from coming along? Well, I, th I think, you know, uh, we're really focused on putting uh, metal cutting at the heart of manufacturing. So for those guys that are involved in the metal cutting process, but I think also captains of industry. Um, we're running seminars uh, which are very much uh, focused on the future. Um, and we're also running tutorials which are focused on how to get the best out of your processes. So I would say probably the how-to, the tutorials, are educational and, and, and it means that guys should learn stuff that they can go away immediately and apply. So if you're working in the, in the metal cutting environment, those absolutely are must for you. And I think also at the same time, the seminars then are focused a bit on the future, a bit on the bigger picture. Um, and I think those are things, those are opportunities for, let's just use the metaphor of a captain on a ship. Right. Yeah? Get out of the engine room. It's important to be in the engine room stoking the fire, let's mm. say. But actually, it's important to get onto the bridge and to have a view. Yeah. To have the bigger view, to see what, what, you know, what is the trajectory we want to go on, who can help us get there, are there any new ideas, are there ways to do things faster and better. So I think that's, it's for both. I think you've kind yeah. of sold it to me already. <laughs> okay. So any more uh, machine demonstrations, anything else going on? Yeah, m many more uh, metal cutting demonstrations. I think we're at 16. Uh, okay. metal cutting demonstrations, uh, covering most industry segments, so aerospace, uh, oil and gas, uh, medical, and some power generation also in there. Uh, so, uh, and, and not just kind of nice mock-up uh, uh, demonstrations, they're real life examples mm. that we've taken together, again, coming back to the collaboration theme, working with customer, working mm -hmm. with the technology partners to really create something that's real. Okay. Uh, I would also say on that, you know, when it comes to collaboration, there's an old African proverb, and it goes like this. Many people have probably heard it. You know, it says, if, if you want to go fast, go alone. But if you want to go far, go together. And I think, you know, for all of us, speed is an issue. But actually, most of us know already that actually we do want to go fast, and we are probably, as engineers, tempted to do that alone. Yes. But actually, I think it's about both. We want to go fast and we want to go far. And the only way that we're going to do that and get it right is to do it together. Yes. So that's what this is about. Optimizing yeah. everything. Yeah. OK, so the Seco event happening on the 9th and 10th of October here in Ulster. You've got to come along.